Super Combo! Master Combo! King Combo! Killer Combo! Ultimate Combo! Available for your home in 1995, only on Nintendo Ultra 64! Welcome everyone to another episode of Twisted Gaming TV. Today is Friday. So today I wanted to do a, um, a short video, um, my reaction to the new Call of Duty Modern Warfare. Um, I think it's going to be awesome, so let's watch the video. Alright, here we go. Helicopters. Ooh, I hope this is real game play footage right there. Oh yeah, it looks like it. Going dark. Going dark. Like the pre the uh, to the open thing. nuke town where everything blows up. That's pretty dope. So let's talk a little bit about it. So I've been playing Call of Duty since the original Modern Warfare, which I want to say that was that came out in 2007. I loved Modern Warfare. Um, I liked Modern Warfare 2. I liked three. Now, on the Black Ops, I really liked Black Ops 1 and Black Ops 2. Didn't really dig Black Ops 3 and 4 even though I bought them. And then like the um, in Infinity uh, Warfare and a couple of other warfares that I didn't like. It's kind of, kind of too futuristic. I'm glad they're going back to the uh, non-futuristic, the actual real-life war types, the, you know, all these crazy, you know, flying off the walls and stuff, that would piss me off because I want to run around and start shooting people, you know, you know, not uh, battling it out with somebody and you got some nut jumping off a wall and doing a flip on your head and blowing your brains out, I mean, that's not realistic, that's stupid with jetpacks and stuff. 
I mean, because, uh, you know, we have real war. We don't have jet plaques, jet packs with people flying around. That's stupid. Um, it was cool at first when they first did that. I forgot what, what Call of Duty when they first started doing the wall stuff. But um, it was fun at first. It was exciting. But then it got annoying because everybody just did that all the time. Anyways, graphics look amazing. Um, it's coming out October 25th. I actually think this Call of Duty is going to be a really good Call of Duty. Um, back to its, you know, good time roots. Um, you know, like I said, Black Ops 3 and Black Ops 4, you know, I just, I like Treyarch games, but I don't know, they were just kind of, you know, need to do something different. So I like going back to the, the good, the good Call of Duty. So we can see if they can pull it off. But uh, supposedly they're 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 gonna have a battle royale um, on here too with over a hundred players, if not a hundred. But I think they said a little over a hundred, maybe. Uh, and then they're gonna have twenty on twenty also. Uh, I think battle royale on that. Uh, I don't know if they, you know, because I just did uh, heard nicks and pieces of it, but I don't know if they're doing a story mode or not. I think I heard they were, but I can't remember. I have to check it out. Anyways, I'm thinking the game's gonna be a great game. Um, they uh, they announced the collector's edition, well, the dark edition. I'll post a picture up now so you can check that out. It has night vision goggles. Of course, I ordered it. I'll do an unboxing uh, on October 25th when, they, when it comes out. So I'll unbox that. I've got a lot of games I gotta unbox too, and so I'll do videos. But anyways, let me know what you think, you know. I, I really like it. I'm, I'm excited for it. Um, so, yeah. Anyways, thank you for watching Twisted Gaming TV. Please comment, like, and subscribe. Always comment back. And I'll have another video coming out tomorrow. See you later.